preamp is at the heart of any audio system, receiving digital and analog signals and routing them through the appropriate signal path. The Mark Levinson engineering team goes through extensive lengths to make sure that the signal is not only preserved, but the conditions are in place to unlock the full potential of the recording. The number 5206, of course, is based heavily on the platform we developed for the number 5805 integrated. It makes use of the work we did on the design of the line stage and the digital to analog converter. Those two building blocks in particular have two patents on circuit designs that are utilized in them. What we did was to repurpose those building blocks, but by putting them into the number 5206, having a separate component, we were able to do some additional work, hot rotting, so to speak, the power supply in the unit, adding another stage of regulation, and adding some very extensive shielding inside the unit. That allows us to minimize noise and maximize the sonic performance of all of those building blocks inside. Inside the number 5206 is a dedicated transformer. All it has to do is to power the analog circuitry in the preamp. That particular transformer is completely encapsulated. It's surrounded on all sides by three layers of silicon steel shielding. It is both mechanically and electrically very quiet, and it's able to produce a lot of power because the number 5206 runs in full class A. In the number 5206, we're using an additional stage of linear regulation for all of the audio circuitry. So our nice, big, encapsulated toroidal transformer powers its very own set of voltage regulators, which in turn feed all of the regulators on the analog stages. That gives a much quieter, more stable DC voltage for the critical analog circuits. In addition, there is a switching power supply that runs all of the digital circuitry. That provides us with much better efficiency and much lower power consumption when the unit's in standby. It's really a combination of the best of both worlds. We wanted a number 5206 preamplifier to be lower profile than the 5805, despite having the same front panel, knobs, and button array. The interior structural parts present a clean interior, but their primary function is to provide shielding between the power supplies, digital circuits, from the analog circuits. There's aluminum, steel, and silicon steel shields, all located in size for optimal performance. The number 5206 offers many digital input choices. There's an AES input, which is a balanced connection considered very reliable, robust. There are two coaxial inputs, two optical inputs, as well as an asynchronous USB input. That asynchronous USB input can handle all kinds of high-res formats. In addition, there's also a Bluetooth input capable of Aptex HD. Now, some people would argue that Bluetooth is not a great high-resolution medium. Why would you include it? The fact is, Bluetooth is a great way for people to share their music, so why not include it but make it sound the best that we can? The number 5206 has even more system control and integration flexibility with IP, RS-232, and rear IR. You could also import and export configuration data from the internal web page directly. We designed the number 5206 to be very flexible. It offers a home theater pass-through feature, which allows it to be integrated into a home theater system. We've also included a discrete high-pass filter, which allows the preamp to be integrated as part of a 2.1 system. The number 5206 has input relays for all of its signal sources. These connect only the signal source that you're listening to, and they physically disconnect all the other signal sources. That prevents crosstalk, interaction between the sources, and helps break up ground loops. One of the best things about the number 5206 is that as soon as I plug my headphones into the front jack of the preamplifier, that preamplifier turns into a headphone amplifier. There's no reason to have a separate headphone amplifier in the unit because all your investment in that preamplifier circuitry is used to bring the ultimate detail to when you're listening to headphones. With two patents awarded, a pure path Class A line stage, the Precision Link 2 DAC, the number 5206 is packed full of features and performance. 